What is going on right now? everybody how are y'all doing before we get started with this video give it a thumbs up broski some big news is circulating the internet ahead of the super smash brothers direct that was confirmed yesterday by nintendo officially bro the next fighter has been data mined and not just that the next three fighters according to this leak that's hot right now on twitter first they're saying terry is releasing on november 6 which makes sense tomorrow is the day of uh, the presentation for terry and typically when um terry is um, discuss whenever they um, talk about a new fighter they release them the same day you dudes are asking why in the world why in the world does obi-wan have a frogger gameplay video behind him we're getting to it bro oh your mind's gonna be blown all right so first let's talk about terry terry releasing november 6 comes with the geese hayachi lloyd irving and hollow knight me fighter outfit so me fighter outfits the stage is called king of fighter stadium online mode slip space comes with version 6.0 we're getting a new online mode what is slip space i don't know yet but this is where things start to get hype bro doom slayer is fighter number five now he's been circulating as far as the next DLC fighter for a while now. But according to this leaker, Doom Slayer is going to be fighter number five. I'm here for that. I'm here for that. It's about time we get another. He reminds me of a Samus. Not Zero Suit Samus, but fully armored Samus type fighter. We don't have too many of those. We have a lot of fighter emblem guys. We have a lot of sword and shield fighters. But another shooter interesting to see what his special abilities will be all that stuff so doom slayer is fighter number five they're saying they're not sure when he will release and in terms of his stage music and outfits yet none of that has been detailed yet also this is where it gets interesting i can only confirm two of the extra dlc fighters that will release after the pass which are bro first gino he's saying gino is going to be one of the dlc fighters bro super mario rpg the legend of the seven stars on the super nintendo fire bro gino was one of my favorite characters in that game. This would be a great nod to old school, old heads. Gino, if Gino comes to Smash, that would be lit. Now, let's go back to that um, Frogger video. He's saying Gino is one, and the next one would be Frogger. That's right. A toad or a frog to be exact. At first I was like, nah. But then I was like, this is the same fighting game that has Mr. Game and Watch. We fit trainer. Duck hunt dog. So anything is on the table. Frogger could be a possibility. Now of all three of these fighters, let's talk about them. Doom Slayer, <laughs> Gino, and Frogger. First, Frogger. This is why I think Frogger is possible. 
This is an iconic gaming franchise. My first video game console was an Atari 7800. I had Frogger on my Atari 7800. Frogger was huge in the arcades. Now he's starting to make a comeback on mobile devices. They have a, like iPhone game or whatnot. But Frogger was huge back in the day. And I remember Sakurai. He had pride. He was prideful of having Pac-Man, Mario, Sonic, and there was another one, four iconic characters in Smash. He was he was proud. I think it was Cloud. But he was proud of having four of these iconic gaming characters all in one game. Frogger is another iconic one. Doom Slayer is another iconic, bro. Why is Doom Slayer iconic? The, if you grew up on the PC, the old school Doom games with just the switch and this makes sense why this is another reason why i think doom slayer makes sense we got doom on the switch doom 2016 a whole bunch of doom games just came out on the eShop, including doom 64 which was a big um game in this in the series we're also getting Doom Eternal. Doom Eternal will be coming out on the Switch. I think I have an eyelash in my eye. That's why I keep rubbing my eye. Doom Eternal has been confirmed coming to the Switch as well. And so, Doom has been... Um, Bethesda has been showing Nintendo a lot of love. Doom Slayer makes sense. I really think this is legit Doom Slayer. Frogger, I also think <coughs> very possible. Just the fact, bro... Once We Fit Trainer was announced, I was like, anything could happen. Any character, if you started out in a video game, you could be in Smash. Super Meat Boy, Meat Boy, anybody. Well, after We Fit Trainer just opened the floodgates, in my opinion. And so Frogger, Frogger, Frogger is said to be one of the characters. Now, if Frogger is announced, there's going to be a lot of hate, rage in the Smash community. But I'm sort of cool with Frogger. Just because he's so iconic and he's so popular. He's popular. One of my issues with Terry. And Terry's coming out tomorrow. I'm going to use him. I'll be hyped. But in the States particularly, for me, I, I guess from my perspective, the two big systems during the 16-bit era were the Sega Genesis and Super Nintendo. I didn't know anyone who had a Neo Geo, bro. A Neo Geo wasn't that big, man. Even in the arcades. In the arcades, it was Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat. Those were the two fighting games in the States. I mean, at least the arcades I went to. There weren't a lot of dudes playing um, King of Fighters and all those games. The Neo Geo games. And so, <coughs> I felt that Terry was more for a niche a core a niche core group where I, I I have big expectations for Smash bro. But we have Doom Slayer, Frogger and Gino. Gino, you see him right here. Gino would be lit. It's almost as if Nintendo was listening to me. Um, because Gino, when they did that voting for characters, I remember Waluigi and Gino being at the top of the list. So, we're going to find out, we're going to find out definitely tomorrow, the presentation tomorrow is going to focus on Terry. Sakurai already said that. I'm not saying it's going to happen, but don't be surprised if we get a tease for Doom Slayer or whoever the next fighter is. We might, we may not. We're going to be live streaming. Either way, I will be live streaming it. Make sure you have your notifications on. You're subscribed to my YouTube channel. Um, 8 a.m. Eastern, uh, Eastern Standard Time is when it's going down in the morning tomorrow. All right, dudes. What do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out. Boy, 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 boy. Uh, let me remove Frogger and Gino. Bye bye. All right, we out. Peace.
Tomorrow's about to be lit, bro.